Hi guys, welcome sa inyong lahat. Welcome to this Math Lessons ni Sir Ken Chong. Math Lessons kasi 2 in 1. Math Lessons at Songs. Ang Math Lessons natin is on determining the converse, inverse, and contrapositive of a conditional statement. So, let's have a review muna. What are conditional statements again? So, conditional statements are also if-then statements. They are written in if-then form to emphasize which part is the hypothesis and which part is the conclusion. So, katabi or kasunod nung if, yung hypothesis, at katabi naman or kasunod nung then, yung conclusion. So, generally, we can write a conditional statement as if P, then Q. P is the hypothesis and Q is the conclusion. Example, if today is Monday, Then, tomorrow is Tuesday. So, ang hypothesis doon ay today is Monday. Conclusion naman is tomorrow is Tuesday. Ayun. So, ang gagawin natin today is to determine the converse, inverse, and contrapositive of a conditional statement. Let's proceed sa una, yung converse. To get the converse of a conditional statement, we simply interchange the hypothesis and the conclusion. Pagbalik ta rin lang natin yung P and Q, yung hypothesis at yung conclusion. So, we now have the statement, if Q, then P. That's the converse. So, the converse, nung example natin kanina ay, if tomorrow is Tuesday, then today is Monday. Ayun, yun yung converse. Next, let's proceed sa inverse naman. To get the inverse of a conditional statement, we simply state the opposites of the hypothesis and the conclusion. So, we now have the statement, if not P, then not Q. That's the inverse. So, we state the opposites. So, yung inverse ng ating example kanina would be, if today is not Monday, then tomorrow is not Tuesday. Ayan. We proceed to the last, contrapositive. So, to get the contrapositive of a conditional statement, dalawa ang gagawin natin. First is to switch the hypothesis and the conclusion. Interchange natin. Pagbalik ta rin natin yung hypothesis at conclusion. And then after that, we state the opposites. So, we now have the statement, if not Q, then not P. That's the contrapositive. Or pwede rin ang gawin natin is from the inverse, balik ta rin natin yung hypothesis at conclusion. Yun na yung contrapositive nung original statement natin. So, the contrapositive of our example would be if tomorrow is not Tuesday, then today is not Monday. Ayun. So, yun na yung math lesson part nung math lessons ni Sir Ken Chong today. So, we now proceed to the songs part. So, isa kasi ito sa favorite lessons ko na tinuturo. Itong conditional statements, converse, inverse, and contrapositive. Kasi I get to incorporate music dun sa discussion ng lesson. So, let's proceed. So, what we do is to think of a song na mayroong conditional statement dun sa lyrics niya. Siyempre, nag-isip na ako kanina. Ang unang song natin is yung sikat ngayon. Sikat ngayon dahil sa bagong music video niya starring Joshua Garcia and Julia Barreto. So, this is Paubaya by Moira de la Torre. Okay. Saan nagsimulang magbago ang lahat? Ilan nung ako'y di na naging sapat? Ba't di mo sinabi nung una pala? kailangan pero di ang mahal at kung masaya ka sa piling niya hindi ko niya ipipilit pa ang tanging hiling ko lang sa kanya Ayo, 
yun. So, kunin lang natin yung parteng may conditional statement. At yun ay yung sa first part ng chorus. At kung masaya ka sa piling niya, hindi ko na ipipili pa. Okay, so let's sing that again. At kung masaya ka sa piling niya, hindi ko na ipipili pa. So, nasan doon yung hypothesis? Masaya ka sa piling niya. Yung conclusion naman is, hindi ko na ipipilit pa. So, to get the converse, we simply switch the hypothesis and conclusion. So, we now have this. At kung hindi ko na ipipilit pa, masaya ka sa piling niya. Let's sing that. At kung hindi ko na ipipilit pa, masaya ka sa piling niya. That's the converse. Now, to get the inverse naman, we state the opposites of the hypothesis and the conclusion. Ano bang kabaliktaran ng masaya ka sa piling niya? Hindi ka masaya sa piling niya. Ayun. How about the opposite of hindi ko na ipipilit pa? Ipipilit ko pa. So, the inverse now would be at kung hindi ka masaya sa piling niya, ito ay ipipilit ko pa. So, nagdagdag tayo ng word na ito para pwede siyang kantahin. Now, let's sing the inverse. At kung di ka masaya sa piling niya, ito ay ipipilit ko pa. That's the inverse. Now, to get the contrapositive naman, we switch the hypothesis and the conclusion, and then state the opposites. Or pwedeng, ang gawin nga natin is, to switch the hypothesis and conclusion ng ating inverse. Yun ang contrapositive. So, it would be, at kung ito ay ipipilit ko pa, hindi ka masaya sa piling niya. Now, let's sing the contrapositive. At kung ito ay ipipilit ko pa, hindi ka masaya sa piling niya. Now, let's try an English song naman. This is Savage Love by Jason Derulo. If I woke up without you, I don't know what I would do. Thought I could be single forever till I met you. Usually don't be falling. Be falling, falling fast You got a way of keeping me coming back to back Every night and every day I try to make you stay But your salvage love Did somebody, did somebody break your heart? Looking like an angel but your savage love When you kiss me I know you don't give to but I still want that savage love Your savage la 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 Your savage la 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 You could use me Cause I still want your savage love So kunin lang natin yung parteng merong conditional statement At yun ay dun sa first part Dun sa first verse natin If I woke up without you, I don't know what I would do so let's sing that again. If I woke up without you, I don't know what I would do. So the hypothesis there is, I woke up without you. Then the conclusion naman is, I don't know what I would do. So to get the converse, we switch the hypothesis and the conclusion. At ito na yan. If I don't know what I would do, I woke up without you. That's the converse. Now to get the inverse naman, we simply state the opposites of the hypothesis and the conclusion. Ano bang opposite ng I woke up without you? E the I woke up with you. How about the opposite of I don't know what I would do? I know what I would do. So the inverse now would be ito. If I woke up with you, then I know what I would do. So dinagdagan natin yung word na then para pumasok dun sa song. 
sumakto dun sa sol. Next, contrapositive. So, yung shortcut ng contrapositive is to switch the hypothesis and conclusion of the inverse. Ito na yan. If I know what I would do, then I walk out with you. Ayan. So, that's all for now. Try nyo rin yung ginawa natin. Think of a song. Tagalog man yan or English na mayroong conditional statement dun sa lyrics niya. And then you determine the converse, inverse, and contrapositive of that statement. And then you sing them. Have fun. So, see you sa next math lesson or songs ni Sir Ken Chong. Bye guys. Kung ako siya Yeah.